Darren Till recently appeared on the Sportsland's YouTube channel where he's asked about the Conor McGregor vs Habib 2.4 million pay-per-view buys. Sportsland's asked Darren if he thinks Sean O'Malley can top those numbers and Darren responded saying no and that he believes Conor will never be coming back. Here's the full clip. Um, Conor vs Khabib, obviously probably the biggest pay-per-view numbers ever, I think, wasn't it? 2.4 million. There's no chance you don't think Sugar can never get up to those numbers. No, I don't. No. I don't think anyone's going to. I think Conor, 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 that was it. Conor's never coming back, in my opinion. But yeah, he's that. still done what he's done. So we can't disregard what the guy done. You yeah. have to give respect. Made history in his in his era, but now clearly he's he's um struggling a bit with. I'm not sure exactly what sure what's going on with him, but he's he just he's just listen. I'll tell you what, Colin's Colin's Colin. Mm, I said Colin, there, me coach Colin. Mm-hmm. Connor's struggling letting go. Yeah, that's why he's struggling with. He doesn't want to let it go, but it's time to let it go now. He's older. He doesn't train like he used to. He, you know, he, he he's got the money. He's got his beautiful kids. The only problem with Connor right now is he just doesn't want to let it go. And there's going to come a day where he's going to go, do you know what? I'm fighting with myself here. I need to let it go. Yeah, I think the lifestyle change is hard to adjust to, isn't it? When you're not training 100% every day and, and all that. Yeah. Every every recording I see he does on Twitter, he's just <laughs> drunk as <laughs> cry my eyes out laughing at them. Yeah, yeah. It's quite funny, but it's also it's a bit... Funny. A bit. Hopefully, he's, he finds something that he can focus on, like he used to, and he, he doesn't. Yeah, fall off. he will. Fall He'll off. find peace sometime. It'll take a while, but he will find it. We spoke about McGregor there briefly, but you know he's saying that the UFC won't let him fight in December. But realistically, I don't think anyone expects him to be in the shape to fight in December anyway. So is he just sort of pushing the buck back at UFC there? Yeah, my whole opinion with Connor's, you know, you have to respect what he's done, but I think it's. Time to let go. I think he's struggling to let go. And uh, I don't know. Maybe he's not. Maybe he's going to come back and prove us all wrong. But from what you see, you know, he doesn't look too ready. I don't know. Either Connor's, he might just not be ready in terms of testing or mm. maybe just wants to keep his name up there and he's looking on the return next year. It's it's tough to know. It's tough to know. He's a, he's a smarter business than... Him businessman than most of us so you have to trust them what he's doing that's all for this video if you enjoyed it make sure you subscribe and hit the bell icon so you can get notified for all future videos thanks for watching